Uh, the posterior mediastinum, uh, this region uh, will uh, house the esophagus. And so if we take a look here, we have the esophagus extending from the superior mediastinum into the posterior mediastinum. We can also see the divisions of the trachea uh, within the posterior mediastinum. Here in this right view, we see the right bronchus, and on the left side, uh, we would have the left bronchus. Uh, some authorities, some anatomists, uh, will assign the primary bronchi into the middle mediastinum, but others uh, will assign these, as I am, into the posterior uh, mediastinum. Uh, I think it's simpler to keep that in mind because anything posterior to the posterior pericardium is then in the posterior mediastinum. And now uh, we can do a brief uh, quizzing session or moment with you to see if you kind of understand where we are uh, within the thoracic cavity. And so we could take a look here at uh, this particular structure and note its relationship uh, to other structures within the thoracic cavity, such as the heart, and then we have our lungs. And so where are we within the mediastinum? Since we are posterior to the heart, uh, this is the esophagus within the posterior mediastinum. If we take a look over here, where are we within the thoracic cavity? Left side of the image, but again, we're viewing this as if we're standing at the feet of a patient looking up toward their head. So this would be the right pleural cavity. Now let's summarize the key take-home messages. The thoracic cavity is divided into three major compartments. We have two pleural cavities, and we have that area standing between them in the middle of the thoracic cavity called the mediastinum. The apex of each lung extends above the clavicle to the level of C7 for the vertebral level, and the inferior uh, limit of the lung will correspond to ribs 6, 8, 10. The mediastinum is divided into superior and inferior divisions by a plane that runs from the sternal angle uh, to an area that is located between T4 and T5. The middle mediastinum is best defined by its major occupant, the heart and pericardium, with the other subdivisions of the inferior mediastinum located anterior to the heart and then posterior to the heart. The points of auscultation of the cardiac valves are located in the right and left second intercostal spaces and the right fourth and left fifth intercostal spaces. The trachea is located in the superior mediastinum as is the esophagus and the esophagus will extend into your posterior mediastinum. And the thymus functions to educate T lymphocytes against self antigens and is located at its maximum development in the anterior and superior mediastinum. Uh, thank you for joining me on uh, this lecture on an overview of the thoracic viscera. You just completed your first video of the world's best medical exam preparation. Lecturio brings the knowledge of worldwide leading medical experts and teaching award winners to your PC, tablet, or smartphone. Prepare yourself and check your progress with thousands of quiz questions, customized to USMLE standards. And the very best, you can get in touch with our medical experts personally. Visit Lecturio.com now and continue with the most inspiring medical education around the globe, anytime, anywhere.